Hey there, Smiles Cut. Welcome back to My Safe Skincare Haven, your ultimate skincare destination where we dive deep into everything related to skincare, self care, and self love. I'm Map Smart, aka Light of the World, the very beautiful face behind Smap Organic Skincare. You already know this. <laughs> if you're new here, welcome and get ready for an amazing journey. Hey there, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we're going to dive deep into and tackle a common concern that many of you have been asking about. Why skincare products may not be working for you. Now, I know it can be really frustrating, like it can be like a very frustrating experience when you invest your time and money into skincare products only to find out that they don't deliver the promised or expected results. But fear not, because we are here to uncover the potential reasons behind it and break it down for you. And I have broken it down into five very important points and I'll be starting with my very first one, which is understanding your skin type. I don't want this video to be too long, so I'm going to try as much as possible to be as brief and as precise as I can be. Now, in my years of experience in this industry, I have had the opportunity to consult with a lot of people, including men, and trust me, 90 to 95% of these people that I have consulted for do not even know their skin type. Even though this is a major factor, each person has a unique skin profile which determines how it reacts to different ingredients and products. So using skincare products that are not specifically formulated for your skin type can lead to suboptimal results. Even when it tells you um, for all skin types, some skin type might actually need more customization like my skin type so I know what I'm saying. So before you go on YouTube or TikTok to watch content creators and review products or before you go and buy that cream, soap or scrub that your friend or sister is using and is giving them the skin tone you desire, take a moment to evaluate your skin type. It is very important to know whether you have an oily skin type, a dry combination, sensitive or even a normal skin type. Understanding your skin type will actually help you to choose the product that has been designed to address your particular skin need and concern. Because not all products work universally for everyone. So if you are using products that are not suitable for your skin, they may not address specific needs and deliver the desired results. Also, identifying your primary concern is very key because sometimes the reason why your skincare products may not be working lies beyond your skincare routine. Because if you have underlying skin conditions like eczema, acne or hormonal imbalance and you don't do anything about them, they can affect the performance of your skin products. In cases like this, it's very important that you consult a dermatologist or a professional skincare person who can diagnose and treat any existing skin issues properly. So try to get personalized recommendation based on your unique skin profile. Don't go buying this soap or that cream because your sister is using that is good on her or because you watched a review on YouTube or TikTok and it's good on her. Now this brings me to my second factor, which is product ingredients and selection. Your skincare products may not be working due to the ingredients that they contain. Skincare formulations varies. They are not the same. And certain um, ingredients may not agree with your skin, causing irritations and allergies. This doesn't mean that the product is bad or the ingredients are bad. Your skin just doesn't like it. It's essential to find out what your skin doesn't like and carefully examine the ingredient list in your product to find any potential triggers. You see why it is important for you to know your skin type and not just going to buy what your friend or sister is using. Alright, so now 
Another thing is if you notice any negative reactions to certain ingredients, consider avoiding them totally and opting for products that are formulated with ingredients known to be beneficial for your skin type. I'm saying this because I know, I understand, I have been there. I don't go close to carrots or anything that has to do with carrots because it doesn't just break me out. It also makes me look red instead of to lighten me. And carrot is something that some people cannot do without. Also salicylic acid that is widely used to treat acne, it breaks me out. Now this doesn't mean that it is bad. It's just that my skin doesn't like them. So another common mistake when it comes to skincare is incorrect product usage. Even if you have carefully selected products suited for your skin type and you use them wrongly, you still face the same problem. Because using products um, improperly can diminish their effectiveness. It's like when you use hydroquinone and go under the sun without sunscreen, it will turn you, you will be dark. When you use, maybe you are treating acne or treating, you know, something and you're using vitamin A, tretinoin, you use that night and then during the day you go out and without sunscreen, you will turn. So it's, it's very important to follow instruction provided by the brand or skincare professional to achieve optimal results. Like using lightning products morning and night is not good. A lot of people are actually guilty of this one many of you are actually guilty of this you tell them buy moisturizer to use during the day and get a sunscreen they'll tell you they don't have money they want the one with spf so that they can use the morning and night even when you get the one that has spf 50 in it you still need sunscreen because you have to reapply the sunscreen every two hours do you want to be reapplying your lightning lotion every two hours no and then you need to moisturize your skin especially when you are lightening your skin that's why you find that sometimes you see people that are really light but their skin is dull their skin isn't glowing it's not because the product is bad it's because they are using it wrongly products that should be lightening and glowing your skin will just be lightening you and drying out your skin and thinning your skin because there is nothing there is no moisture in that skin so you that you want to be light, you have to know bleaching is not for the poor. Bleaching is not for someone that is suffering. I have seen people who use Caro White. And if you, are see, if you see their skin, you will not believe that it is Caro White they are using. And other times, I have seen people who use like very expensive skincare products. When they mention the name of the products and the amount they got it for, you won't believe it. Why? Because they are using those products wrongly. Like I said, I don't want I don't I don't want this video to be too long, so I'll just move on to my fourth, which is external factor. So sometimes external factors can also play a significant role if in the effectiveness of skincare products. Environmental conditions like air pollution, sun exposure, harsh weather change in season or exposure to harmful chemicals can all compromise the results of your products. We also have lifestyle factors under this like poor diet, stress, lack of sleep, smoking. All of this can affect your skin health and impact the efficacy of your skincare products. So to maximize the effectiveness of your skincare routine, try to minimize exposure to environmental factors and external aggressors. Incorporate a healthy and balanced diet, manage stress levels, get sufficient sleep. <laughs> Very important. <laughs> and prioritize overall lifestyle choices that support healthy skin. Protect your skin by wearing sunscreen. I said this in my other point. Avoid ash chemicals like those products that promises you three days fast whitening action. Avoid them and maintain a healthy lifestyle. Lastly, patience and realistic expectations. You see five days action on a product and you buy it because it's a five days action. <laughs> 
So one crucial aspect of one crucial aspect to remember is that skincare is not an overnight fix. It is not magic. Skincare products typically take time to show visible results, and having unrealistic expectations can lead to disappointment. That's why people come to your comment section and tell you the product is not working. Like I said earlier, not all ingredients work for everyone and sometimes certain ingredients can cause adverse reactions or allergies that's why you see us we come back to give you different options of lotions that you can use because we know that not all products can work for everybody so choose the one that works for you choose the one that we mentioned that can treat that your skin condition that you already have or that can treat your skin um, issue, the skin issue you already have that you're facing. Choose the one that we have mentioned that will treat it. And the one that we have mentioned that is for this your skin type. Don't go and buy a lotion that is gold because they say the gold is the strongest. Just because you want fast action. Meanwhile, you know that your skin cannot take that strongest. Choose wisely, Leo. I've told you my own carrots I don't go near it so it's essential to read product labels thoroughly become aware of their skin sensitivities and avoid ingredients that may trigger negative reactions steroid is something I also stay away from because it causes me to break out all over my body so it's also very important to be patient and consistent in your skincare routine giving your products enough time to work their magic some people you use a product for seven days you're already waiting you're already looking you're already telling me oh no it's not working seven days your skin cells have not even they've not even rejuvenated and you want to start seeing results in seven days Abba. how you have to be patient. A lot of people do not have patience. That's why you see them jumping from this lotion to this lotion to this soap to this oil every two market days. You will end up damaging your skin. Small organic skincare is quickly here to treat. Just owe better money before you enter my DM. If you know that you know get better money to treat your skin, make sure that you are patient and consistent in your skincare routine give your product enough time to work and please don't fall for this market claims and expect miracles from skincare products all those ones that will tell you seven days white action <laughs> please don't fall for them they are all marketing strategies so while skincare products can actually help to improve your skin's health and appearance they also have their limitations they cannot completely alter your genetic makeup or reverse deep-rooted skin issues so have realistic expectations and remember that skincare is an ongoing process that requires consistent effort and time. It is not magic. Nevertheless, the continued use of the right products and the right approach, you can actually achieve improvement in your skin's health and conditions. So if you are wondering why skincare products aren't working for you, Consider all these factors that I have mentioned Your skin type the product ingredients and usage external influences and managing your expectations Remember skincare is a personal journey with numerous variables at play and Finding the right products may require some trial and error So it's okay when you use a product and it's not good for you After you have given it time of course so if you are still struggling to find the right product or experiencing persistent skin concerns, it's also a good idea to consult a professional skincare therapist or a dermatologist who can provide expert guidance and tailored recommendations for your unique skin needs. We hope that this video shed some light and has helped you understand why your skincare products might not be working for you. If you find this information helpful, don't forget to give it a thumb up and subscribe to our channel for more skincare tips and discussions and click on
bell icon so that you'll be first to know when we drop a new video. Take care of your skin and we'll see you in our next video. Keep pumping your skin.